hi guys uh, welcome to another video on improve your Excel today I came up with uh, Excel add-in uh, which uh, save and split the Excel sheets into separate files with uh, multiple options okay so we can uh, separate the multiple files uh, and we would like to uh, split the sheets into the current folder or we can split them into the subfolder within the current folder so let's get started and we'll open that uh, also we'll open that file uh, which contains uh, the data uh, with the sheets like name and address name and street name and city state postal no name full address okay so that uh, particular file contains four sheets but we have uh, macros error okay here we'll close this sheet and I will right click on that option uh, on the particular Excel file and I'll go to the properties so now we have a situation here so the max of Excel uh, whenever you download any file from any source so Microsoft Excel uh, actually block the macros and you have to enable them I'll click on that checkbox unblock apply ok so same process I'll repeat with the Excel adding file unblock apply and ok so now let's open that file okay as uh, we discussed the this particular excel file uh, contains four sheets and i'll show you the way how we can uh, split that four sheets into files okay so we have default tab here okay so this one is my macros that uh, this uh, particular tab i have created for my personal work but uh, when once I uh, open the Excel add-in file so there will be a new tab uh, called macros will be added here in this section uh, I think after the developer tab okay so let's do this I'll go here and I'll double click on that file okay so once I double click on that file so that file will uh, triggered and will added a tab after the developer tab like uh, here macros okay so let me do this so we have a tab name here uh, called uh, split sheets into files under the macros tab okay so once I click on this so a user form will be triggered okay now mm, the user form says save sheets as separate files and there's one more line which says sheets in this book will be saved as separate files to certain folder and we have uh, different options here uh, in that user form sheets to save okay we have option to save all sheets uh, uh, if your file uh, for, for, any, for any instance if your file has 11 sheets so will uh, if I want to process the 11 all the sheets 11 okay so I will check this box all so all visible sheets okay so you have hidden sheets in your file so and you only want to process the only the visible sheets you can uh, check this box selected sheets only so this option will be uh, select for those sheets you have selected okay I'll do this for you okay now I will select three sheets okay so I want to go with the three sheets okay so for the selected sheets only you will check this box and save to you can save the sheets uh, as files into subfolder with added date time in current folder uh, you have option to save the files into current folder or you can select the folder by clicking on this tab okay 
and how to save the last portion here file name you can type any random name here or you can select the name uh, from this drop down menu the most and important part is the file type okay so you have bunch of options to save your excel files into different formats like excel sm uh, excel sb excel s okay pdf csv and text you have bunch of options here to use all right so there's a last option here replace formulas to values if your data contains any formulas and you don't want to uh, process those formulas as formulas into uh, files okay so you just need to uh, click on that checkbox so this checkbox uh, this so so this once you click that checkbox and press okay so if your uh, sheets contains formulas so that way your sheets will be saved as file and your formulas values will be saved as a uh, uh, value right so so the my current sheet that is here with uh, that name name and address name and street all right so actually um, uh, this data file uh, does not contain any formula here so let's do this all visible here and what i'll do this i'll okay let me select the folder here okay I don't want to show this thing to you so download okay so I'll choose this folder to save once I click OK so it will process and it will trigger a window and would give me an option do you want to open the uh, folder where you have saved that sheets as files okay so no I don't need I have that uh, folder already opened in my windows okay so now you can see this all right sheets have been saved okay let's open the one sheet so open the one file and see all right so we have all the data here and see all right so that way this Excel add-in works Okay, I hope you have liked the video. If you would like to download this file, I have uh, given the uh, download link in the uh, description of this video. All right, please subscribe my channel. Thank you for your time. Take care. Bye.